The Guam Air National Guard has over 400 airmen, and the Outstanding Airmen of the Year Banquet is an opportunity for the Air Guard to recognize and honor its finest airmen. The nominees come from each of the Guard's four units, the 254th Air Base Group, the 254th Red Horse Squadron, the 254th Security Force, and the 254th Force Support. The awardees were selected from four categories, Airman, Non-Commissioned Officer, Senior Non-Commissioned Officer, and First Sergeant. First Sergeant of the Year Honoree Master Sergeant Philip Tyron is with the 254th Red Horse Squadron and explains how an officer is nominated. What happens is a, uh, a write-up is prepared uh, in regard to uh, what your performance has been, uh, significant accomplishments, uh, some of the things that you've probably done uh, off-duty, um, additional uh, education, um, like uh, attaining higher education, and then also uh, your uh, involvement in the community is a big thing. Tyron believes his outside community involvement played a big role. Well, I've actually uh, participated uh, um, assisting with my son's uh, basketball team and then um, there are some other things that I do also at the school, uh, just making sure that I get the support to my, uh, my kids as they uh, have different programs. Technical Sergeant Keisha Duenas was awarded the Non-Commissioned Officer of the Year Award and praised the importance of such an event. It's important to have these types of recognition because it gives a chance for us to highlight our outstanding airmen, give them a chance to represent and just be proud of what they've accomplished throughout the years. Senior Airman Michael Artero from the Security Forces Group received the Airman's Award and credits his volunteer work when off duty and his goal of self-improving. He offers a piece of advice for his fellow officers. Just take uh, the opportunities that the Guard, the National Guard provides you and you'll be on your way to receiving such an award.